Good evening, everyone. Joe for Jaspies, CaseBreaks.com, our brand new website. Check it out. 2018 Panini Illusions Football coming at you. Eight box. Pick your team number seven from Jaspies, CaseBreaks.com. There, there's everyone right there in this break. There's the list right here, too. Here's the official printout. There's everyone right there. Good luck. Now, let me pop open the case behind me, and I'll I'll mark the uh, I'll mark the case, the inner cases, the eight box inners, left and right, and then we'll roll the die, and we'll see which side we're gonna do. Be right back. All right, so we'll roll the die. Um, one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. And it's going to be three. So one, two, three for the left side. You can see right here, marked it L. For the left side. To say who got the bill, Last Bob Mojo asking, hey, how's Illusions? My first break for this product. It's like any other break, To say It's good if you hit. And it's terrible if you don't hit. Even if it's good. I think that's how it goes. If you don't hit, you're going to be like, ah, oh, terrible. What a terrible product. If you do hit, it's the best thing in the world. No, it's a solid. It, Illusions is pretty solid. It's a, uh, I would consider it. I don't. I don't think it's like a super high end product or anything like that. But I would consider it a solid mid range product. If we didn't think it was good, we wouldn't carry it. I mean, they they can't all be flawless in National Treasures. Those are like super high end releases. Got to mix in some uh, some Illusions in there too. Solid mid range release. I think one update this year that I really like in Illusions compared to uh, last year is that all the encased cards, these are all encased, are all autos. I think last year some, some of them were just, uh, they could just be just a low numbered card or something like that encased for you, but I think upgrading it to an auto was I think was definitely the right way to go. It was a nice touch. All right, good luck everybody. Thanks for filling this one up. This break should take about I don't know, about 30, 40 minutes from now. So get comfortable, settle in. And then after that, we should have a little under an hour left in the broadcast. So if you if you have your eye on something else, um, mention it in the chat. Let people know what you want to try to get into after this. And that might kind of help spark the momentum and fill up another break before we call it a night. All right. Good luck, everyone. Here we go. There's Sam Darnold right here out of 149. We'll top load. We'll sleeve and top load all of those before they go out. These um, matching numbers cards right here, unless they're numbered 25 and under, we'll just go left, right on those. Just makes life a little bit easier instead of randomizing two dozen of those cards out of 199. And our first hit is going to be Kalen Balaj, first impressions jersey and autograph out of 449. That'll go to the Dolphins. That'll be for Fidel Cairo. Um, I think Mr. Cairo is in, in Miami or in Florida somewhere. He may be a Dolphins fan. If you are, I broke my heart, Fidel. I thought I thought they they were up seventeen nothing, on the on the cat team, and they just kind of squandered that lead. I don't know what happened. They just it just kind of melted away. 
There's Dante Pettis, first impressions, two color patch out of 100. I think Niners, you know, after Jimmy Garoppolo went down, I don't think really have too much of a shot. But I'm hoping that guys like Dante Pettis can emerge. We'll randomize that to one person in the break. If there's more, then um, winner take all in the points. There are the Colts. Legacies dual rally, 23 out of 100. Edrin James and Neam Hines. Oh, yeah, the Colts were the Thursday night game. They got rocked. Although the scoreline doesn't make it doesn't doesn't make it look as bad as as it seems, but they were, they were getting rocked for sure by the Patriots. Traquan Smith, good for the hobby that he caught uh, Drew Brees' pass for a seventy-five yard touchdown or something like that. That gave Drew Brees the passing yards record I believe all right let's set these aside here we'll keep these over here All right, and the encase card. Good luck. It's going to be Traquan Smith. We were just talking about you, Traquan. 26 out of 150. Nice time to get this autograph. James Simers with the Saints. Excellent time to get this autograph. Part of history. No matter what he, what, well, I'm rooting for him for his entire career to be great. But no matter what happens in his career, he'll always be part of that history. For those of you who, uh, for entertainment purposes only, follow our picks. Had uh, Pittsburgh minus three. They did well. I think they took care of the, the their opponent pretty handily. Playing the uh, the Falcons. Falcons defense just their offense really couldn't get anything going. I think uh, Steelers defense really showed up, but that Falcons offense or Falcons defense really banged up, and they they allowed the Steelers to put up 41 on them. Um, had the uh, had Miami plus six. You guys heard about that? Plus six was not good. Uh, had KC minus three in Kansas City against Blake Bortles. Blake Bortles on the road in Kansas City. I think that was a e relatively easy choice for me. Um, relatively easy choice for me. Then I had Oakland plus five. That's not good. At a one forty nine. For the Carolina Panthers, illusionists. Is he an illusionist, DJ Moore? I'd like to see DJ Moore do well. Connor's doing what they should trade Le'Veon Bell. I heard some Le'Veon Bell talk. Le'Veon. I think the Eagles should get him, right? First impressions, two-color jersey and auto, Mike White. Out of 75. It's a good one for the Cowboys. That'll be for Chris Perrin. They should trade him to the... Uh, listen, Jay Ajayi just went down. ACL injury. He's done for the season. And a free agent after this season. So they don't have Jay Ajayi. You know, Le'Veon Bell, would, they really don't have a lot of other... Definitely a living legend right here. They really don't have anyone else in the backfield that can, re that can replace that production. And then to get like in a an elite running back like Le'Veon Bell on that team, 
That could really kickstart a lot of things for, for, the, for the Eagles. Got a randomizer here. Six out of ten. Hunter Henry. Poor Hunter Henry. O.J. Howard, Hayden Hurst. Hayden Hurst back in action, too. Could be a good sleeper candidate for your fantasy teams. So that'll be a randomizer at the end. We'll set that right here so I don't forget. There's Matt Ryan. 187 out of 399. I don't I I think that's pretty fair. A top pick, maybe a second rounder and a good player for Bell. I don't think that's that bad. There's Jake Elliott, speaking of the Eagles, 25 out of 50 for the Fly Eagles Fly. Peter Kay with the Eagles. I think they, um, they renegotiated a contract with somebody on that team. Fletcher Cox, maybe? And I think that opens up the necessary cap space they need to get that Le'Veon Bell deal done. Now, I think Ian Rappaport reported, reported that the Eagles weren't interested in Le'Veon Bell, I'm sure. Just they weren't interested at the price the Steelers gave them. There's Marquez Valdez-Scanling. Good for the hobby. Three out of 49. Hashtag good for the hobby. His performance. Hashtag good for the hobby. Aaron Rodgers, no receivers. Had to turn to Scanling. Or Valdez Scanling. Looks pretty good. Uh, James Simers with the Green Bay Packers. If all the Steelers want is a second rounder, I would do it. Why not? What have you got to lose? You know, the it's hard it's hard to get back. It's hard to get to the Super Bowl, let alone win the Super Bowl, let alone get back to the Super Bowl after you've won a Super Bowl. You need to do things like that to to reinvigorate a team. Big move like that. And with the uh and with the NFC East looking as weak as it does. Redskins don't look good. And the Redskins look, look okay. And Cowboys aren't looking that great. You know, Giants aren't going to do anything this season. So so the Eagles could win that division with like an 8-8 eight, eight and eight record, 9-7 and seven record. Add Le'Veon Bell. You go into the playoffs with that. You know, Carson Wentz knocking off all the rust. And I wouldn't want to see that team in the playoffs. Christian Kirk. I think he had a good day too. Jersey and autograph. 80 out of 99. There's that Cardinals game. Let's look at the box score in that game. Rosen threw for 170 and a touchdown. And Christian Kirk, three receptions for 85 yards. What a long 75 yard touchdown. That'll do it. That is also good for the hobby. If Rosen and Christian Kirk develop a connection there, I think that would be fantastic. And behind this matching numbers card is Adam Thielen, 237 out of 399. BM Willie? I'm not sure what that not sure what that is, DH. There's Mike Kosicki. First impressions relic out of four ninety nine. That'll be for the Dolphins. That goes to Fidel Cairo.
But Dupree... Yeah, Thielen's doing well. Poor Jay Ajayi. And the judge, Ito Smith. First impressions jersey and autograph. 143 out of 149. Johnny with the Falcons. And your encased card. Is going to be. Whoa! Team Tandem's dual autograph, Ray Lewis and Ed Reed. Woo! That is hot. Who's got the purple birds? Fidel Cairo with the Ravens. That is nice. That is a strong encased card. I like that. Both on card, too. Both on card. Nice. Yeah, how is that not numbered? I, I was kind of looking for that. I was kind of like, where's... No serial number on this. They, it may just be, it may just be short printed. I can't imagine them signing like, you know, having them sign like hundreds of those cards. It, it's got to be short printed, just not serial numbered. Sorry about that. Messed up my fingernail there for a second. I don't know how that happened. Need more calcium. Brandon Thomas, I'm calling it Jalen Samuels redemption in this case. Oh, just got to put that on the record. David No saying, Joe, I heard it can take years to get a redemption. Yes, it could. Most of them you'll, you'll get within a timely manner. But sometimes, yeah, there, sometimes players don't sign their cards. <laughs> All right, for the Bills, Austin Prohl. Bills are on the board out of 199. But I think most cases, redemptions actually are relatively quick. Depends on the player, though. Carry on my wayward son. First impressions, two-color jersey and auto. Out of 25. Nice.
John Samus has done some research for us. There are only three Team Tandem cards. Ravens, Patriots, and Bears. Does not say print run, though. Nice. Right, so that's not, not a very common one. We've got Rookie Idols dual memorabilia. 24 out of 25. Ito Smith and Devonta Freeman. It's a nice one for the Falcons. There you go, Johnny. Black and gold. Scott saying, I've got some from 2014. When when was your um when was your uh what how long have you been waiting for your Giannis autograph? Behind Russell Wilson is Michael Thomas, twenty four out twenty five, nice three color patch, spotlight relic for the Saints, James Simers. Oh, last month? No, you, still have, you still have plenty of time. It's last month. You don't have to worry about that. Sorry, I had to change channel. There's no way I was going to end up watching... Big Bang Theory. Big Lame Theory. And, and listen, folks, for the for like redemptions that take take a bit of time, you can always uh, you can always get a comparable uh, a comparable card in value. They'll often do so something like that for you. There's Joshua Jackson, 16 out of 199. And that'll go to the Packers. That'll be for James Simers with the Pack. All right, we're halfway through this eight box inner case. Um, no, I don't like Young Sheldon either. Not a, not a, not a Big Bang Theory guy. Never did it for me. Is this the last season? I sure hope so. <laughs> no, I don't, I, don't, I don't really care. I don't hate the Big Bang Theory. I just, I don't watch it. Not a, not a, not really a sitcom guy. Not really a fan of, what's the other show that a lot of people seem to like? Uh, How I Met Your Mother. Not a fan of that. I think it's lame. Give me NFL films. The Autumn Wind is a Raider. Bo Jackson, Marcus Allen, Marshawn Lynch. Legacies, Triple Relic, 2 out of 50. That goes to the Raiders. It's for TJ, my Raiders. There's Dante Pettis, Jersey and Auto out of 299. Give me the wire. I'm a fan of the wire. The wire and cartoons. Simpsons. Family Guy. Bob's Burgers. 
Give me that. Or The Wire. Love The Wire. Marquez Valdez Scantling out of 490. New Magnum's good? Yeah, but old Magnum PI, a lot better, right? New Magnum PI doesn't have Tom Selleck. A great mustache. What next? A new Airwolf? Uh, Chase Litton out of 100. It's lit. Going to the X line and the Chiefs. Um, Brandon Thomas asking me a very generational question that I don't think I can answer. Who do I think is better, Lyle Azedo, uh or Howie Long? The only thing I've seen of them is uh, what I've seen in documentaries. And YouTube highlights. So I don't, I don't know if I could really truly answer that. Nice Cortland Sutton. 21 out of 75. Mystique autograph. Just like the... Just like Rebecca Romaine's character in X-Men. Do I have a... I don't have any blank cards next to me here. I was going to try to see if I could... I'm going to show you the mysticness of this card. But there you go. Nice one for the Broncos. Oppo Joe Mojo going to David No and the Broncos. Least favorite season. I know. Fine. Dave's like finally a hit. Least season. I think that's everyone's least, least favorite season. The second season in the, uh, in the shipyard. The docks. Although... Although you, if you once you watch the entire series, you can see how that fits in and why that was necessary to see. Um, you know, so I I, th I think uh, it was still kind of a slower, sort of a slower sort of uh, thing. But I th I think it was important though to get the full scope of. Of you know what Baltimore was and to a certain extent what it what it is like. But the I think I did a rewatch of that a uh, I did a rewatch of that a year or two ago, and it's I was surprised at how well it it held up. I don't think I first I didn't see it when it was originally released, um, but I did see it. Uh, you know, many years after that, and then did another rewatch a few years after that, still held up, and then did another rewatch recently, maybe a couple years ago, and it's still it's probably due for another rewatch, but it's, it still holds up. Holds up. First impressions were like Dante Pettis. John Samuelson saying, I'm a teacher, so, oh, when Prez teaches, you really like that season. Yeah, the school season is really good, um, and, uh, I have a little background in journalism, so I enjoyed all the Baltimore Sun, like all the journalist stuff. I thought it was really cool too. But I think it's cool. It's one of the few series that dedicates itself to really, to really tying in everything. Like it can tie in like the school system with the politics, city politics, with the journalists, with the cops, and with the kids on the street. It really delivers like it's such a huge scope but it for some reason it delivers that and the moral ambiguity that everyone has in those industries politics police streets everything there's first impressions anthony miller out of 100 that'll go to the bears that'll be for andy garner there you go andy And behind Terrell Suggs is Taiwan Taylor. Autograph. Nice. Four out of 25. That'll be for Amy Thompson and the Titans. Nice. 
Never seen Breaking Bad. Uh, actually, I saw the series finale. And one episode at a car wash. That's about all I've seen. And um, I've only seen a couple episodes of... I've only seen a couple seasons of... Um, or a couple episodes of Game of Thrones. Uh, only only Game of Thrones I've seen is um, is the is the wedding episode, and then one episode where Captain Phasma in Star Wars is t is like chaperoning this little kid. All right, that's all I got. Rashawn Penny, of course, is your redemption. First impressions, autograph, memorabilia, blue for the Seahawks. Amy with the Seahawks as well. Oh, that's actually. Brandon Thomas, but it'll go to Amy Thompson. That's who the package will be <laughs> will be addressed to. I do need. I want to watch the uh, the Stranger Things, Andy. I definitely need to need to get around to that. Um, you're about to install Mojave. I'm not sure what that is, John Samuelson. There's Marshawn Lynch, my boy Marshawn. Three out of ten. Nice Marshawn Lynch for TJ and my Raiders. There you go, Tej. Beast mode. Beast mode. Oh, Apple's new operating system. You don't see a lot of Marshawn Lynches. Um, that's only out of ten. There's only ten of them. Um, oh, Apple's new OS. What, on your telephone? Or your computadora? I'm not an Apple user. So I don't know. I use an iPad. That's the only Apple device that I have is an iPad, which I like a lot. Oh, it's a desktop. Why... What are the reasons for you being nervous, though? Hey, wait, John. Are you gonna? Are you visiting next week? Didn't I? Didn't I hear tell tale? Didn't I hear? I hear a tale told that a John Samuelson may may reach our doorstep next week. What are the reasons for being nervous? I guess any any sort of major is it is it a major opera OS upgrade? I guess that would make me nervous too. Your trip is up in the air right now. Okay. Well, let us know. We'd be happy to. Have. We ha we had Arthur Peru here earlier today. Be nice to see, nice to see more of you guys. Show your faces here, so I'll know what your face looks like when I don't pull you any hits. Sad faces and your happy faces. All right, second to last box. We've got first impressions, Sony Michelle. That'll be for the Patriots, Karen, with her pats. That's true. Apple updates always always could be scary. I feel like any major major operating system update can be scary. There was a there was a major Windows update I think recently. Something like that. But <laughs> I think I read somewhere that if you did not have enough space in your hard drive or enough uh, empty space in your hard drive, like the update would start erasing things. So they they nip that in the bud pretty quickly right after that. But there's still like a handful of people, a hand, probably more than a handful of people who had issues like that. And I was like, that's terrifying. <laughs> I was like thinking of our computer here. I was like, oh, we got so much stuff on here. 46 out of 50, Ray Ray McLeod. Nice one for the Bills. It's, not, it's for uh, Toussaint. So you got Austin Prohl. You got... Ray Ray McLeod. Now we need the third rookie on that team, which would be a, a, a one Josh Allen. All right, there's uh, Deshaun Jackson, D Jax, 174 out of 399 for the Buccaneers. That'll be for Ron Hollins. Brandon Thomas says, I live in PA, so kind of a far drive. But if you're ever in that area, absolutely. Well, let us know. Hey, listen, when, it's, uh, when you're knee deep in snow, 
and you're watching the stream when I whenever I go on air and it's still like daylight and the, and it's blue skies out there, I think you may be motivated for a little vacation. We are just moments away from LAX. We are airport close. You can easily work in a nice California va Southern California vacation. Little Jaspies, little Disneyland, little little beach. It'd be great. There's Anthony Miller, first impressions, jersey and auto. Catch more touchdowns, Anthony Miller. I feel like he's could be on the cusp of breaking out. That would be hashtag good for the hobby. Andy with the Bears. There you go, Andy. I want this guy to do well. I've got him stashed on my fantasy bench too, my fantasy team. I finally lost this week. I'm 4-1 and one now, folks, after a blazing start. Good question, Ty. Ty's like, what's moments away in LA? Uh, we are just five miles south of LAX, which means it'll take you probably an hour to get here. <laughs> There's Kalen Village, red ink autograph, 22 out of 49 for Fidel Cairo and the Miami Dolphins. Bienvenidos a Miami. which I learned from a Will Smith song. No, I already know what Bienvenidos means. I already know what that means. All right. All right, Brandon Thomas. Hey, I'm telling you, I, I encourage everyone every year. I encourage, no one's, no one's taking me up on this. On this. I'm all, I tell you to everyone, hey, you know, it's, uh, when the winter time comes around and you're like in Michigan or in Milwaukee or in Indiana and blah, 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 you know, Pennsylvania, and you're knee deep in snow, you know, feel, hey, come visit me in LA. You know, weather's nice. You'll, all you need is like jeans and a hoodie for most of the winter. So I'm like, hey, come by. Rex, you should come by in the winter. Bring the family. Arthur Peru is here. Brought the kids, went to Disneyland. Stop by Jaspies, hung out for a while, boom. No, Elon Musk isn't going to get those tunnels done. Elon Musk is a fraud. I still want to get one of his Teslas, but he's a fraud. He's a, he's a Wizard of Oz. There's Arden Key for TJ. Nice. The key to the Raiders' defense. You like that? No, Pen Rashad Penny doesn't sign at all. No, he signed in some cards, some sets. I think some whatever sets where he's where there's stickers of him, he, they'll put the stickers on. But whenever there are sets where he has to sign them on card, he just hasn't done them yet. I don't know what the holdup is. Dante Pettis, and another Anthony Miller, another first impressions auto, jersey and auto for Andy Garner and the Bears out of 449. Someday, Brandon, someday the Raiders will, <laughs> Brandon's like, I can't wait to see the Raiders start balling out again. It's not going to happen this year. I can see it. In a few years, but I just thought the I just thought the timing would be a little bit sooner. But the big coaching change and getting rid of Khalil Mack, I think I think that process is kind of started over again. Unfortunately, <sighs> this is my life as a Raiders fan. There's Sam Darnold, one of one. Woo! Look at that. Sam Darnold, Mystique, one of one. So that is for Marvin. I wish it was autographed. <laughs> but that is strong. Kind of 
kind of put the car. You can see the the sort of shadow in the background there of Sam Darnold throwing the ball. There it is. Marvin with the Jets. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop. First impressions, James Washington out of 490 for the Steelers. That'll be for Scott. All right, no worries. Well, let's see if we got something nice here too. I feel like we haven't seen a big wait, we haven't seen a big rookie auto yet. Right here are our encased autographs. Kalen Bellage. I guess Marshawn Lynch is a pretty big one. Cortland Sutton, Joshua Jackson, Marquez Valdez Scanling, Tracon Smith. I guess we did get this dual autograph. I was thinking maybe one one big rookie in here. The QB names, maybe. I don't know, we'll see. Alright, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Last one. We have the uh, second inner case in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com, so check that out. Plus plenty of more football. And it's Leighton Vander Esch out of 199. Chris Parent with the Cowboys. There you go. Cowboys at the end. A pretty solid break, everybody. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. Got a couple randomizers. You've got the left-right randomizer. You've got this triple relic, and everyone has a shot at the points. So let's go to random.org. There's the dice. Let's grab one, two, three lists. First one is for the left, right. We've got the Legacies Triple Relic, which is Hunter Henry, not San Diego, LA Chargers now, Buccaneers, and Baltimore Ravens. They moved. And everyone has a shot at the points. Some from Fidel down to Scott. Let's get everyone's name in here. And let's randomize all the lists, one and a four, five times for each list. Left, right first. One, two, three, four, and a one, five times. Left side will get them. The Legacies Triple Relic, Hunter Henry, O.J. Howard, Hayden Hurst, Chargers, Buccaneers, Ravens. One and a four, five times. One, two, three, four, and a one, five times. Tampa Bay Buccaneers on top. Ron Hollins with the Bucks. There you go. And the little consolation points here. Once again, five times. One, two, three, four, and a one, five times. After five times, we've got Fidel Cairo with an extra 150 points coming your way. And there you have it, folks. Thanks for getting into Illusions number seven. Next one is in the store on our brand new website, jazbeescasebreaks.com. Please check it out. Sign up for the site. Register for the site. Sign up for the newsletter. Even if you don't buy anything, sign up for the newsletter because um, we're starting to add a little more promo codes in our email blasts and everything. So keep an eye out on your inboxes. Make sure our emails aren't going to spam. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.